All right, so we're doing a dumbbell type workout. We're gonna do bands as well. There's only so much you can do dumbbells. Bands are so much more versatile. But what I wanna do today, I got 100 pounds for 30 reps last time I did these. I'd like to beat that. I don't know where I'm gonna be right now. Uh, my body's a little sore. I took it to the limit with the bands this week. We really went really hard. But nonetheless, I wanna see what I got here after that. So we am wrap. So basically do enough sets to warm up. For me, I did 50 pounds for, um, for like seven reps, eight reps. Then I did 75 pounds for three to four reps. So now I'm warmed up to go up to 100 so I won't hurt myself, but also haven't exhausted anything, right? Because if you're going for an AMRAP, you wanna make sure you have all your energy reserves. AMRAP means as many reps as possible. So I'm gonna put music on. Don't give a fuck about royalties anymore. I simply want a PR. Today it's gonna be all about the Benjamins, featuring the Notorious B.I.G. So um, let's get these Benjamins, baby. Uh, 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 yeah, buddy. What was that, 34? 32. Because it's all about the Benjamins, baby. So this is the last non-banded movement we're going to do. Dumbbell flies. In fact, I prefer flies with bands. Um, what's really funny is I don't know how my gym workouts are going to go. Because um, I honestly prefer, excuse me, I prefer the bands over a lot of the movements I did with weights. So even though I have access, you know, I just wanna see where my strength is, but what I found, there's no way I could've done 100 pound dumbbells for, uh, for 32 reps before I started doing the bands, or at least, I, I mean, my body was just getting pounded on. Maybe I'm getting stronger and getting healthier, I don't know. But like I said, even when we go back to the gym, you're gonna see a lot of hybrid workouts, and hopefully your gym's open as well. Unless you're in New York or LA. LA, they're filling fucking skate parks with fucking sand. Fucking Nazis. Serious? Serious. They filled the Venice skate park. What's Look it up. They're fucking Nazis, bro. Like, what wow. the fuck? Anyway. Ugh. Flies. Ugh. Come down. Slight bend in the elbow. Up. You don't want to come all the way up because then your chest isn't really flexing. Right here is when you have the peak contraction. So come down. Up. Down until you're about parallel with your chest. Yeah. <sighs> 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 All right, so I'm doing 10. I'm, I'm exhausted from that shit I did before. So what we're gonna find, it gets doing the dumbbells, the barbells, the machines, is I almost see it being 50-50, 50%. -50. 50% traditional load, 50% bands. And I want to, uh, he, he shared my shit yesterday. I want to give a shout out to James Grage. He's the OG on this shit. Like I'm just picking up the torch. He's only one voice, but James has been preaching this band and he wasn't even doing weights. Like we trained together three years ago. He was doing mostly cables and a little bit of dumbbells. And then he figured he could do with, with bands what he's doing with cables, but do it outside um, in my, well, that's what I see anyway. But. I don't know what his real fucking story is about the band. He hasn't, he hasn't had any injuries. No, well, the reason is he got in a motorcycle accident years ago. Oh. So lifting weights for him was harsh because yeah. his body's like fucking piecemeal and Play-Doh'd back together, right? Okay. So, you know, I understand now. And James, honestly, he looks better now. The last two and a half years, it's almost three years now, he's been doing nothing but bands, not one fucking barbell. And uh, he looks better than he did when we hung out together three years ago. So, you know, and you can tell by looking at James, he ain't on gobs and gobs of steroids, right? He's just, he's always been a good looking dude. He used to be a great bodybuilder back when he competed. Um, but like, you can't argue that results, man. And those of you who say you don't get as much from bands as you do with weights, 
I just don't think you've given it a shot. I think you've gone in expecting it to suck and it sucked. But you actually go in there and you give in and you know, and you actually believe it's gonna work and you really squeeze the muscle and you use the bands the way I'm showing you, you're gonna love it too. If you'd have told me I'd be around weights doing a fucking rubber band like a month ago, I'd have told you you're fucking out of your mind. Actually, it's a month and a half ago. Anyway, so we're, this is our unilateral movement. Press, one. It's an extra heavy band. All right, and switch. You can do eight. My chest is spent, but right now it's just adding insult to hopefully no injury. <laughs> Gotta get a pose for this, right? Ah, that's how you do it. Seven and eight. All right, guys, for this, four sets, eight reps. All right, y'all, check it out. So we did bilateral dumbbell press, bilateral dumbbell fly, unilateral banded press. Now we're gonna unilateral banded fly. Step out, hopefully I can still do extra heavy. Okay, okay. oh yeah, I got it. Four. All right, switch inside. You wanna flip around? I don't think they wanna see my butt, Katie. No, I did, so. Well, that's, that's, that's about the only person. All right, come in here. And eight. All right, guys. Four sets, eight each side. So I do have a crossover machine. If you don't have this, you know the uh, banded flies we do, where you put it against something and you do them both hands at the same time. Even put it across your back and do this, that's fine. I have this, so I'm going to use it. What I use it by? Eh. You know what? It's here. I don't use it all the time, but it's chest day, whatever. So we're just going to do a nice, clean squeeze. Again, I still think I feel bands. What do you think, Katie? Mm -hmm. I think I feel bands a bit more. Mm -hmm. Me too. My chest pretty much gone at this point. But anyway, there's 10 solid reps. Do four sets of 10. So we have a little bit of extra time. Honestly, it's Sunday. Kids are playing ball. We ain't got shit to do, man. Um, and if you haven't noticed, the world's kind of locked down. I can't go to the shopping mall. Can't do any of the cool things. I actually never did shit. That's kind of what we'd be doing anyway. But anyways, <laughs> we'd be, if we don't have a soccer game or a soccer practice, we just work. Like we're a pretty simple family. Anyway, tricep press downs. If you notice, this rack is real, real high. Even with the extra heavy, I can't bring it. I can't go out wide because it's too hard. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually do this. Let's do this. Let's do palms down. One. Oh God, this is so much better than cables. Because the strength curve, like where the elbows hurt is right here. When I get down more right here, it's where the elbows don't hurt. Then it gets harder and harder at the bottom. So it's just such it's so mechanically advantageous to the body's natural strength curve. Fuck yeah, that sounded smart. All right, so this is the last exercise. <laughs> By the way, I was watching your triceps, and so my <laughs> kind of went like, you have no head in the video. I don't need a head, but I need some head. Anyway, guys, so check it out. So we're going to finish this up. Um, do four sets, 10 to 15 reps, whatever. Um, this is our chest day. Now, again, the beginning, if you don't have dumbbells, do the push-up superset. You have the band across the back. Do three steps AMRAP at the beginning, okay? Second thing you want to do for the flies. Again, attach to the back of this, do some flies. So many different variations, be creative. If you have a gym, throw, but trust me on this. Even if you go to the gym, bring a bag of bands with you. Here's what the undersun bag looks like. It's a bag, it says undersun. All the bands fit in this bag. And that'll fit within your MTS Nutrition gym bag you bought from Tiger Fitness earlier, because they're dope. I'm sure most of you have them. We've sold over probably 10,000 of them. So a lot of y'all have them. I know my views aren't that high. All y'all have that bag. If you don't, I think we still have some bags on Tiger Fitness. But anyway, guys, we'll be back tomorrow. Tomorrow we will train back. Back. Okay, guys? So we will see you tomorrow. Have a great day.